Don't need any family. Sign up for free cell phones. Till some thieves robbed him of his tablet. Now see if you recognize the guys who did it. Nice thing. And Fox 26 News' very own Marie Edinger takes you along as she flies with the Navy's legendary Blue Angels. Join us on the flight of your life. Tonight on Fox 26 News at 10. That means some nice weather over the next several days. Those storms and more right now. You're watching Fox 26, your hometown news connection. And now, Fox 26 News at 10 o'clock. I'm there to give them a phone. <laughs> I'm there to give them a job. Why so do you need to take away my tablet? A man says he was just doing his job, giving up free phones, when a guy he's been trying to help rides up and snatches the iPad he uses for work. Good evening. I'm Liz Monsatis. Hello, I'm Monty Torres. Thank you for joining us. Well, tonight that man is without what he says is a critical tool for him to do his job. Fox 26, your hometown news connection reporter, Kimberly Colliner, joins us now to explain what exactly happened. Kimberly, how is he doing tonight? Monty, well, he's definitely shaken up, but more so than that, he's just upset. That iPad is how he jots down people's information in order to get them approved for that free phone. It's something he says he takes so much joy in doing. Seeing them smile when I give them a phone, and, you know, you know, it's really rewarding. I really love that. Jaime Cervantes loves what he does. He hands out free phones for a living, and that's what you see him trying to do right here. Oh, so, you know, I approach him and say, uh, hello, um, you want to get a free phone? For whatever reason, this guy here says no, rides off on his bike, and Cervante carries on to set up his Lifeline phone station at the Beacon on Olive and Peach in Southeast Fresno. That's him right here. The guy on his bike hangs around, riding in circles, and finally stops to talk to this other guy before doing this. He went up really quickly on his bike, going after me, and grab a tablet. He rides right past Cervantes, snatches the iPad that was on his backpack, and rides off. Cervantes even chasing after him, which then caused him to get hurt. I actually fell right on my heart monitor, and then I have this little thing that that um, that tells me how fast my heart is beating. I have an irregular heart pulse. But he says he felt he had to do it. I just put food on the table for me and my, uh, my mom. My mom is 79. So now he's worried about providing, and he can't wrap his head around why this theft had to happen. I'm there to give him a phone. I'm there to give them a job. Why does he need to take away my job and deserve my business? I don't get that. We looked into how many thefts have happened near Olive and Peach in the last three months. There's been 18. They don't all fit on the screen, but three of them were actually robberies, so a weapon or intimidation was used. Cervantes says Lifeline, the company he works for, will thankfully help him get a new iPad, but that likely won't happen until next week. So for now, he's having to put a pause on that job he loves so much, Monty. Sorry to hear that. I'm glad to hear, though, that he is not hurt in that. Cervantes has filed a theft report with Fresno Police. If you have any information on the guy you saw in video right here, you're asked to give him a call. That number is 559-621-7000. Fox 26 News Tracker.